Okay, this is going to be a quick demonstration of a little system I just threw together in Office 365. We're going to create some Microsoft Forms, uh, just real simple kind of example forms. We're going to get a sharing link from these forms, and we're going to put them into this SharePoint list. We'll just put the link of the form, the sharing link in here. That is going to trigger a Power Automate flow right here which is going to run and it's going to call a little Python script that I wrote and I have hosted in Microsoft Azure. Um, it's a function app in Azure. Um, and it's gonna call this and this Python is going to create a QR code and it's gonna return that to, it's gonna return that to our flow. And then our flow is going to write that QR code here into the SharePoint list. So we'll get a little table here that'll have all of our all of our forms and our QR codes. And so we'll just demonstrate that here real quick. So let's go to our first form. Let's go to share. We're gonna copy the sharing link and I'm just gonna click new. We're gonna call it form one and I'm gonna paste the link and I'm gonna hit save. Okay, so now that has triggered. So we've got the first one in here. Let's just go ahead and add the other one while we're waiting. Let's click share, copy. We're gonna paste that there and we'll call this form two. Hit save. Okay, and here we go. It only took a couple seconds and as you see, we've got our form one, we've got the link to the form, and we've also got a QR code. And I will, um, I'll go ahead and open that up on the phone as well, just to demonstrate that that works. Okay, here I am on my phone. I'm gonna pop open this first QR code, make it bigger, scan it with the phone, and it's going to hop me over to form number one in my web browser. I'm gonna go back, I'm going to click on the next QR code to pop it open, scanning it, it's hopping me over to form number two in my web browser. And that's really all there is to it. The way it works is we've got this Power Automate flow here that's triggered by when an item is created on that QR code uh, list. When that happens, it just sends this HTTP call, um, this post, HTTP post to um, our Azure function app that's running a little bit of Python code that makes the QR code. Um, as you see, that's it's really speedy. It only it doesn't even take a second to run and return back that QR code. Um, this is a premium connector, so you'll have to have a premium connector. That's like a fifteen dollar um, per user per month to get um, the premium connectors with Power Automate, but the, it's well worth it. Um, so you get your premium connector to call the uh, function app in Azure. Um, that comes back, and we do a little formatting here. We create the file. And then we've got to do a few other steps to, to basically add that file into the SharePoint list. It's not quite straightforward yet to add an image into the SharePoint list just so that you can see, just so that image you know shows up there in the list like this right here. Um, also, obviously, you can add a step into that flow to email. You can email this somewhere. Um, or you could stick it, you could even stick it into a Word document, like a template or something, or on a website, whatever. There's all kinds of things you could do with it. And you can put it other places too. It doesn't have to be a SharePoint list. It could be a Dataverse database. It could be a SQL Server database. It could be a lot of things. And that HTTP post step in the flow calls this, this uh, function app right here that's in our Azure. And it's this pretty short little Python code right here. It's not a lot to it. Um, this is pretty, it's, um, it's not that hard to set up. Um, if you, uh, Azure, some people aren't into Azure yet, but it's, it's pretty easy to get set up and going in Azure. And it's pretty economical, like uh, once you get this up and going, the function app, I believe, off the top of my head, it's, um, I think it's 20 cents for a million executions of this. So for it's like for 20 cents, I'm covered uh, until I run this like a million times, then I charge another 20 cents. And then on top of that, you're also charged a gigabyte per second fee. 
So it's just the amount of data that is being processed here times the seconds times something like 0. 0.00016. So it's a real it's a real low figure. So you can if you're thinking you're going to be running a whole lot of gigabytes through this for a lot of time, then you might want to uh, calculate that out. But as you saw, it just took like um, less than a second to run this and the images come back, they're pretty small. In fact, we can go ahead and just save one right here and take a look at how big the image is. And as you see, it's down here, it's like a little bit under two megabytes for that image. So thanks for watching. That's just a little demonstration of the things um, I can do with Power Automate, SharePoint, MS Forms, Python script, and Azure function apps, making QR codes. Thanks for watching.